Welcome back. It's Friday, and we like to send you into the weekend with some positive feelings. This week, dogs at the Harland and Humane Society took a break from chowing down dog food. Local 23's Derek Garcia explains. These cookies are sweet, but who's making them and where they're headed are even sweeter. The students in Mr. Andres Gonzalez's animal science class are baking treats for dogs at the Harland and Humane Society. If all my kids are baking cookies, I can't take all that home. So I was like, well, you know what? I know someone who needs it. Let's take it to the Humane Society. The lesson is to create a food product with nutrition in mind. The heart-shaped treats are made with ingredients you can find in most kitchens and bakeries. Oats, peanut butter, flour, eggs, and milk. Since this is for a grade, the treats got to pass the taste test. We want to help out the dogs, we want to help out the people over there so they don't have to spend the money to buy the treats. We make them themselves and give them to them. It's a bittersweet moment for sophomore Abigail Yamas. Man, I really want to take that dog home. <laughs> the whole point of the class is to be a learning experience. But the students walked away with a doggone good life lesson. You know, if you want a dog or cat, come to the Humane Society. You know, there's still hope for them. Like, there's hope for all of us that one day we're still going to find that one place we can call home. In Harlingen, Derek Garcia, Local 23 News. A feel-good story for those doggies. Well, we'll have a final look at...